and you want to do the whole rainbow. What do you do? You make a column. So making column in art is so much fun. I just love like seeing you make the color and everything. Just so satisfying to me. I don't know why. It's just super fun. I love making my color to make new color that I don't have. It's like amazing. So I have blue, red, yellow, the primary color. And I'm going to tell you guys on how you make them, make the whole rainbow and everything. So basically in here in black and white are really colored to be honest. So here's a fact. So here's a fact. Black and white are really colored. Naturally like not colored I guess. I don't know. All I know is they're not really real colored in a rainbow I guess. So I could use black and white. So yeah. But if you don't have black and white I'll still tell you guys on how you make a whole rainbow with three colors. So, also here's another tip, tip for painting, is don't you walk out when you're like dipping a paintbrush in, always dry your paintbrush before like paint, dipping it into the paint, like anything. Now that's like a big tip right here, so yeah, anyway, now I'm gonna make the rainbow color with only three colors. And there are like 6 colors in the rainbow or 7, I don't know how many colors there are in the rainbow. All I know is the rainbow, so I'm going to make some colors from these colors. So, let's go. So here's my casting area. I have this red color, this yellow color, and this blue color. And I have black and white if I wanted to make it darker or pastel looking. Like I have my wall here. Oh my god. Okay. This is just going amazing. Anyway, so, on my wall, I'm not going to use it. I'm just going to, like, wash off the paint from the paper. So, I'll pull off my nails. Amazing. Anyway, let's get started. So, I'm going to get off my thing right now. So, how do you make purple? Like, it's like, I have a red orange. How do you make orange? Simple. Red and yellow make orange. So, let's do it. You know, super simple. And I feel like everyone can know this way. So red and yellow make it ring. And also if my cutting and walking it, I'm gonna be making a new cat. So I'm gonna get it right here. a little bit yellow if you want. If you want a really dark yellow, add a lot of yellow. If you really want a pastel yellow, just add a little bit of silver. So this is actually like a really dark orange. I kind of want a wild yellow. Wait, orange. What am I talking about? So hopefully it's a wild. Look at that. So cool. So right now I'm making my orange because that's how you make the color orange. So this is the color orange. It's not amazing. But I'm just gonna... Actually, what am I going to do with this? I don't know. What can I do? So, I'm just going to dab it on here. Just like a cloth. Paint. You know, I don't want to do it. I'm just doing something random. Okay, and it's amazing. Okay, here's a dab of orange. But if you want to make it lighter, just add some white. If you want to make it super dark, add some, a little bit of black. But I actually want mine to be perfect. But I'm going to do a pastel orange color. So I'm going to show you guys how to do a pastel orange color. So if you want a pastel orange, just add some white. Like, I use white all the time. Like, white is a must have. Like, for me, white, I love white. And one of you have a pastel creamy orange. So with three colors, with two colors, you can make a pastel orange. So amazing, right? Right, I'm gonna get it on. That's amazing. 
Why? <laughs> huh, it looks super amazing. I just need to get things we see in color. It looks amazing. Mm -hmm. So for the next color we're going to be making is green. So for green, all you need is yellow and blue if you want to make the color green. So let's do it. So if you want like a lighter green, you can add the yellow first. If you want a darker green, then add the blue first, get the yellow, I don't know, and make a different or anything. So I have my paint palette here, I'm just going to add some yellow. Do whatever I like that. And then I'm going to add some blue. Yeah, a little dab of blue. And now I'm going to make it. Here's my color. This is the color green. It looks amazing. It's a bit dark green. You can do the same thing. Let me show you that. Just clean up. And add some white to make it pastel. And then you can see it on your paper. And you just mix, mix, mix. And voila. Um, yeah, it's purple because I only got a green, blue, purple. So, me, I'm gonna mix red and blue. Who knew that when you got me to make purple and red and blue? Me, right now? Because I already knew. Well, this will be really tricky because you listen closely. Pay attention to this purple color. You know, purple color can turn into a brown color, or a gray color, or a gray color. And, uh, you know, so you have some red. You add that in just a little bit. You don't want to add too much red. If you want a darker color, then, yeah, I don't know. And if it's too dark, just add white in because it's not really a color. Oh. And also my cutting are also going to learn this thingy. I'm going to teach them on how to make color with only three colors. So, let me fun. So, I'm mixing it in. Let's see. Okay, never mind. Get me off. Guys, this is what happened. The blue fell. No, it's fine. I can't. So, I'm just going to keep mixing until it can hopefully turn into color. And you see what happens, have fun. So I actually turn into this like dark blue color. Which we do not want a dark blue color. We want a like a light purple color. So hopefully I'm gonna add a little bit more red. The purple is tricky, I told you guys. It's gonna be tricky for me. I don't know, I just always have a hard time making purple. I don't know, I just mean that I don't like making purple. That's why I only buy the purple from the store. So it's kind of going to get darker, which is good. But we want a pastel purple. But before I do that, I'm just going to... Okay, so I'm going to dab it on here. Like that. And then this is how the dark purple turned out to be. It kind of looks like a more bluish color than a purple color, but hey, we're gonna turn it into purple by using the magical light. I know, I know. Don't taste me. <laughs> I keep getting a blue on me. So we're gonna keep making. Hopefully, it turns into what's called a pastel purple. Oh my god! What if it's not turning into a pastel purple? <gasps> And it'll be really bad. I know, it kind of looks like a gray color. If you want a purple color, not a gray color. Like, it's not even... Oh, I'm using a lot of white. And it's kind of bad. So, also, I'm going to do the same thing with my cutting when she comes back from England. That's why I'm doing this video beforehand. So, here's a pastel purple. Um, not a favorite. Um, this is probably not my favorite color of purple, but it's pastel purple. Hmm. Okay. Anyway, you know, come now, can you, um, maybe if you add a little bit of blue. Hopefully. I don't know. I'm not an artist that 
being for money. I'm going to put back in the okay? I'm going to put back in the okay? I'm going to put back in the okay? I'm going to put back in the I'm not making paint. I don't know. I'm just putting paint. I'm going to make paint colors. I think I got color light. Maybe? Guys, I got purple. It's a bit dark purple, but don't worry. I'm going to add a lot of light. I'm gonna get the perfect purple here, guys. No matter how long it will take for me to do this. Me, I feel like get perfect. It's kind of like a great purple, but I guess I... Here, I'll show you guys. So it's actually kind of like a great purple, but it's still a purple, huh? I'm gonna put it right here. Let's go, we got purple. And that is how you make purple. Amazing. So I got one more color to make in this video. If you want to see more color, then comment below. Stay huh. tuned, so I have some exciting news for my color. And look, I got paint on my pen. So I'm getting a brown color. I'm going to make every color. And voila! I mean, I need to add a little bit more light. Uh, to make it a light of brown. Um, and here we go. That is a perfect brown color. That's amazing. So, Unfortunately, I don't have a lot of time for now to do lots of colors. But stay tuned because I do have some off lessons for my cutting. Stay tuned because he's going to be loving this video when I do this vlog because he's going to be so happy because he always wants me to help her paint or something. So this is going to be even more amazing. So, with three colors, you can make six colors in a rainbow. This is super amazing because it can be really helpful to use the colon. You know, not really like pack your colon, but it's kind of a pack I don't want to use all of my white I have, so that's why. Anyway, so if you want more of these off videos, um, I would love to do them. I'm going to do them with my cousin because he loves painting. He doesn't really know how to paint. Well, he doesn't know how to paint on paper, but... He needs a little bit more practice, my cutting. So I'm going to keep my cutting while I'm filming it. So stay tuned. Stay to me. But before we end this video, make sure you know what to do. Like, subscribe, so stay tuned, you know all that. And I'll see you guys back in the next video. And it's going to be super fun. By the time I upload this video, my cutting will be home. Like in America, not in England. So hopefully my tongue didn't come quick. So, yeah. And then I guess the end of this video, I did a lot of talking, talking, talking. But it's not all that thing. So I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Peace out.